Good day everyone, welcome to my channel. So in this video tutorial guys, I will teach you on how to declare in use go to XY in Dev C++. Before we start, I would like to say thank you so much to all my viewers, silent viewers, and supporters in my channel. Thank you for watching my videos. If you are new with my channel and then you like this video, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share and please support my channel guys by clicking the subscribe button. So let's begin. I will put a link in the video description where you can download the complete source code of our tutorial video for today for free in my two websites. Okay, so what is the purpose of GoToXY? Actually, the GoToXY is not a standard uh, uh, command in C++. I repeat, it is not a standard command in C++. It is additional library command that can be found in div C++ which adds functionality to your program so basically go to xy uh, command will allow uh, allows us no to put a certain text in a specific coordinate like column and row so x is your column y is your row so we have here sharp include the stream for input output to use the go to xy command we have to declare this library file windows.h this belongs to c as we all know, in C++, you can combine C commands no, together with C++, and we have also steadylib, no? standard library file for system POS, using namespace, int, main, begin, and then I have here a prototype, void, go to xy, short, x and y, go to xy, column 25, row 5, I wrote this, go to xy, the text, and console out, go to xy, in dev, C++, new line here, system POS. The system pulse belongs to this library files. Uh, sharp includes to the lib that h belongs to your C language. Now in a function void go to xy, we have your coordinate position, pause for position, x and y, set, console, cursor position, get handler, handle, steady output handle, pos, definition of go to xy function, and then we close. Don't worry guys because I will put a link in the video description where you can download the complete source code of our tutorial video for today. So let us go to our dev C++ and then we have to check our program. Compile and run. Okay, we have here at, go, at column 25 row 5, we have here go to xy in dev C++. How about we change this now? from 25 to 20 and then the row will be 10 no? let us save compile and run let us wait okay as you can see it changed the position of our text go to x y in dev c++ from column 25 row 5 we have here column 20 row 10 no? so we have here the output of go to x y and dev c++ okay guys so this is the end of our tutorial video on how to use and declare go to x y and dev c++ um, ide okay so this command can be used only in dev c++ if you use it on a different c++ compiler most likely it will not work Thank you so much guys for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and please support me channel guys by clicking the subscribe button. See you in the next video tutorial guys. This is your friend Jake saying bye-bye for now.